council have said this doesn't fit in with the landscape here. This is what Parvani Hall looks like from the road. All you can see is hundreds of ash and oak and hawthorn and apple trees and other trees that I planted with these hands. The building's hidden in behind there. You have to be an invited guest into my garden to find Parvani Hall. So objections that it doesn't suit the architecture of the neighborhood doesn't really hold water. This is Parvani Hall. I think it's beautiful. It took a lot of hands, a lot of years to make it. Every bit of wood was hand cut and carved. It's all local timber. It was all locally milled. Recycled materials that we gathered over the years here. But I planted enough trees around here, like five acres of trees, that with the passing of time, the ash or maple trees can be the firewood for it. I, I believe in planting generations ahead. I think it's the old way. I even planted a stand of larch to replace the cladding when the cladding would rot in 30 or 40 years' time. So there's a stand of larch further on down they're growing. Uh, usually when houses are built around here, all the trees are bulldozed out the way, the old walls are bulldozed the way, and the lawn is set up in front. I thought it'd be good to let the birds sing around, to let these apples fall from the trees, to have something, a wild nook. People love this space, but I'm not allowed to invite anyone here, so it's been lying here for the last three years. It has to be torn down. I want Parvani Hall to stand. Yeah, and we might have a dance every now and again, or a little party. Oh, but that's probably illegal as well. It's the country you're living in, folks. You're free, as long as you don't want to do anything. I brought up four children in this house, and this was the garden I used to play in. In the middle of all of this fiasco, my wife left. When the planning authorities came down, the letters started coming in. It seemed like there was no hope. Further expense, more paperwork, another few years wondering, will it go this way, will it go that way? Strain of it was too much. She's gonna live an ordinary life. Left me here with these broken dreams which could become living dreams. Is this the kind of thing that we shouldn't see any of? Or is it something that we need more of? People could come together, share their skills, share their enthusiasms, share their love of nature and being together in new ways and in old ways. It's important that these experiments take place. It's important socially, it's important culturally, it's important to preserve our heritage, it's important to renew Irish spirituality, which has taken so many blows lately. There's a huge upwelling need for it. People really wanted this to happen. I felt called that something had to be made here. I'm up for the fight. I'll battle for this. It's not going to be taken down, but I need your help. Please join us. Make known what's happening here, and if you'd like to offer any kind of support, you're welcome. Come on, Galway County Council. Let's talk. I guess save Parvani Hall. Not a